Okay, so the next question that we have over here is, how do we write 1.5 million in numbers? So I'm assuming this is asking us just to write kind of all the zeros associated with 1.5 million. So here, 1.5 million, this is a dot or a decimal point in kind of the full kind of numerical way. So we can start off with a simpler um, number. So we know 10 is one zero. So this is 10. We know 100 is two zeros. Oh, sorry for the, so it was just 100. And then we have a thousand, which is three zeros. So, oh, whoops. Okay, so I think we get the gist here. So this is one thousand. So knowing this, we can go further. So we know ten thousand is three zeros. I'll put a comma here so we can see the number of zeros. And then one hundred thousand. is five zeros and then from a hundred thousand if we add one more zero that gives us one million so this is one million so knowing this um we kind of started out from you know this the simpler numbers that we already know 10 100 how many zeros and built off to get to our, we figure out, to figure out how many zeros are in a million. So from here, we can multiply 1 million by 1.5 to get our solution. So if you multiply this by 1.5, we essentially have to move the decimal point whenever we're multiplying by 10 or uh, multiples of 10 uh, with many zeros. We count the number of zeros here, and then we move the decimal point over by the number of zeros. So here we have six zero, six zeros, so we have to move the decimal point over six times. Here, I'll, I'll remove some of the stuff up here. So we have 1.5, 5, and then we're gonna move one, two, three, four, five, six. And in each spot, we're just gonna add a zero. One, two, three, four, five. So here, we only add five zeros because the first zero is accounted for in moving the decimal place over the five. And knowing this, since now we've moved the decimal place over, now the decimal point is at the end. You don't necessarily have to write it, but just to tell you where it is. And we're left with 1.5 million, but in a numerical format. So we can put commas between every three digits just to make it look, at, make it look a little clearer. And this is our final solution. So this is 1.5 million in a, in a numbers format, per se. So here, looking at the solution. So they're giving a similar solution. They've separated out their commas a little differently, but they have the correct number of zeros. So they have five zeros and then 15. So, so usually when you put your commas, um, you do them between every three digits to kind of account for every 1,000 multiple. So we finished solving this question.